New tonight, we've learned that the Pulaski County Jail is using padlocks inside the facility for safety reasons. Our Alexis Wainwright has been following this story and spoke with the sheriff. Alexis, what's he saying tonight? Well, Laura, tonight the Pulaski County Sheriff tells me that this isn't something he wanted to do, but he had to do to ensure safety. Now, Pulaski County Sheriff Eric Higgins says that they have a locking system in the jail that is outdated. It's to the point where inmates are able to pop a lock and come out of an individual cell. So they've been working on replacing those locks, and they were given approval from the Quorum Corps back in February for $1.2 million for this project. Now, it takes about three weeks to do each unit, but in the Meantime, they are using padlocks. Higgins tells me they don't want someone to be able to come out of their cell and assault someone else or a deputy. We have uh, deputies in the unit with the keys for those padlocks, and, and they're able to open up all those locks. It's not like a, a whole handful of keys are all keyed the same uh, in that unit so that we can quickly uh, get people out if, if that was necessary. And as they get the new locks in, then they won't have to use the padlocks. Sheriff Higgins says they just got new locks in August, and so far, four units are done. Now, Higgins says that this could take a while. Up until next spring is when this might be done. Coming up tonight at 6 here on KRK, hear more of the issues they're facing that is prolonging this process. But for now, reporting live in Little Rock, Alexis Wainwright, KRK 4 News. Alexis.